Hey, what's up? Well, I'm going to try to attempt to make a, a quick, short follow-up video, and I'd like to have these two come out very closely. And, um, see, I just kind of brush my teeth, so I hope I don't have toothpaste. Um, but what I'd like to talk about in this video, kind of a follow-up, um, and some more AI dolls. I just can't get enough of making AI generated images of dolls because I really do think that AI could, if they would only let it, take the doll industry into a whole new direction. Um, and right now we're kind of in between September and October. I think it's September the 29th today. So anything I want to do this month kind of has to happen within the next 48 hours. Oh my God. Oh my gosh. So, real quick, I want to do somewhat of an unboxing. No, I couldn't unbox him. But he's just a cheap hollow kin. He smelled like an ash tree. And what I like about him is how he's hollow, you know, like so many Barbies and so few kins. There was only a brief period of time, roughly the 70s and 80s, I guess, maybe a little into the 90s, when there was a high enough demand for male dolls to have cheap, hollow alternatives, which is why they go for more than some better-made Mattel kins of today. Um, so, you know, I'm glad I have him, but I had to disinfect his clothes and sort of fumigate him, you know, wash him, you know, and, and so you put baking soda and vinegar and just kind of leave him out. So, you know, he was not more trouble than he's worth, but a lot of trouble. So anyway, I feel like AI, um, it, it could really take the doll industry to a whole new level because, um, it's just amazing what images of non-existent dolls you can generate um, using AI, simple AI prompts. And while they never come out quite like what I had in mind, they're pretty good. Thought I heard something, but no. So anyway. What I want to talk about is how... Um, you know, I have all these AI-generated images of chocolate factory characters as dolls. And, um, you know, I, I wanted to go into more detail about um, my past obsessions. I think it was pretty much just two years in a row, I want to say. Third and fourth grade. Um, 93 and summer of 93, summer of 94 that I was truly obsessed with that movie and the characters, especially 94. You know, I don't know why the obsession hit me harder. Oh, I, actually I do. The first, the summer of 93, yeah, I'm starting to remember it. Near the end of third grade, we only, well, the, the teacher read the book. And so, I don't think I'd ever seen the movie, oddly enough, as of summer 93, but I was obsessed with it nonetheless, based on only what I knew from the book. And so, that summer, I drew a really dumb looking picture. I'm actually glad I don't still have it, because it was pretty awful from what I remember. Um... And to look at it, you would never, you could never guess as to who or what it was supposed to be based on how I drew it at the age of almost 10. So I became briefly obsessed that summer with the characters based on the book. And because I drew them based only on the book and not the movie, having never seen the movie, I don't think... I came to some very strange conclusions 
as to what I assume, how I assume that they should look. Didn't know anything about the characters. Didn't really understand anything, you know, about the countries that in the movie they were said to be from, or pay attention to that. And so I drew these characters in such a way that um, to look at them, you'd have no idea as to who or what they were supposed to be. They just look like five random kids. You know, three boys, two girls. They just look like five kids that maybe were classmates or something. You'd have never guessed who they were. But... So, you know, I drew them, but, you know, with, with no, um, no, nothing but perhaps the sketches in the book that I may have looked upon and been mildly influenced by that. But, you know, I didn't make them really even close to that because Augustus came out not looking anywhere near fat enough. It's like I couldn't stand to make him truly as fat. So anyway, so I'm going to post a video, um, I'm in a different room, and I'm going to finish it out here and just say that, um, I had no idea what I was drawing, but I got it wrong and AI gets it right. <laughs>